What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My mom and I are officially in Salem, so welcome to our Salem vlog. Usually this would be in October, but I'm going to be a little busy just giving birth in October, so we're seeing it in the spring, which we've never done. So it's going to be more probably like New England vibes, wouldn't you say? I'd say. Yeah, so that's what we're doing. We're excited. We're about to go eat lunch. We just got in around 12 or 1, so we're going to go eat lunch. I wore like a cute-ish airport outfit so I didn't have to change. So this is what I'm wearing. If you watch my travel vlog, then you've already seen this. Even though I said, you're fine. Even though I, said I was wearing a white shirt in that. Um, but I'm just wearing black short sleeve. I have my jacket over my shoulders because it's hot out. Um, but I might want it. And then I have linen pants. And then comfy shoes. So that's the outfit. And then my little crossbody but we're really hungry so we're gonna skedaddle we'll see you at lunch this everyone's ahead of my mom we're at the lunch at the lunch my mom got a try my mom gets a try everywhere and throws away half of them because they're not good enough don't record me I'm going to. I'm going to try. <laughs> try. She doesn't literally like chai. She gets every chai and she's like, eh. And it, it tastes like chai. It tastes like a chai. <laughs> I mean, it was in her book. I feel like they might say Turner's. Maybe Turner's? Maybe. I'm going to ask old boy when he comes back. Okay. I'll probably say here. Yeah. Mickey Mouse when we were Disney the first time. Mm -hmm. Okay, we just ate lunch. We're at the Ropes Mansion. We're going to go look at the gardens. This was Allison's house in Hocus Pocus, if you didn't know. We'll show you the front one when I'm done. You're taking a break. I'm sitting on a bench. Um, I feel like we're gonna have to be taking a lot more breaks this time because I get out of breath so easily. Um, so yeah, I got um, a little print. We stopped in a shop and I thought this was really cute to frame somewhere, like maybe in my one of my bathrooms, but it's like a little star girl. I thought it was so cute. So that's all I've purchased so far. I'll keep you updated on all my purchases. I'm gonna try not to go like too crazy. But yeah. I think I got the wrong thing. Mm. It smells good too. I can have that, right? Fish? Yeah. Okay. Jump scare. I look different. <laughs> we ordered pizza. Where is it from? Okay, we well, ordered it. Okay. What was I gonna say? Pizza. Oh, it's nice to order girl pizza with vegetables on it and no meat because I'm not with Brad. Love you, Brad. But it's nice to not get double pepperoni. Because <laughs> he doesn't like vegetables on mm -hmm. things. Yeah, but he eats more than me. They're, um,. How is it? Their mushrooms are not the kind that we like, but what are we like? Not those that come in a can. Oh, no. It's okay. 
They're good. It's good. It's good peeps. I took the littlest one. We're watching Gilmore Girls. Because that is what we do. Hello, it's day two. We're about to leave to go eat breakfast. I'm wearing my sweatpant jeans today. Super duper cute. They're insane. So believable. They're insane. These are sweats. Look at that. Just a moment for those. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go. We're really hungry. We're getting headaches and we're getting grouchy. So we'll catch up when I, we're in better spirits. Okay, we're not hangry anymore, we ate. We ended up just eating at Gulu again because we like it. So we're gonna go shop now. We have a list of things we'd like to get done today. but it's in the evening. What time is it? It's in the evening. 7.50, it's almost eight. We're eating ice cream. We've had quite a day. Um, I got my aura photographed, which I'll show you when we get back. It's insane. It's so cool. And then I'll show you like the comparison from last time. It was two years ago. Then I, we both got um, psychic readings. Mine was a little interesting. None of it was necessarily wrong, but it just wasn't like amazing. Um, and I tried to record it and it didn't record for some reason so I think I was meant to just disregard that a lot of it wasn't even about me it was about Brad so I like called Brad and I was like I literally just paid for you to get a reading apparently you're not even in the state and then my mom's was about me <laughs> and my unborn child so neither one of us we decided needed a reading and apparently that's what that was trying to tell us so we learned a $45 lesson that we don't need a reading in life right now. Or that we just need to wait for Shalimar. Because maybe just our people were not there. I had a guy, which like I was being very open-minded because I'm usually like not into having a guy do the reading, but I was trying to be like, whatever. And he was good, like there was nothing wrong with him, but I don't know. Like some of it was like reaching. And when he starts saying like, that's because of your pain. I'm like, and that's where you lose me. Mine wasn't detailed, like at all. Yeah. It's more just rabbit trails of life advice. Like generic. So if you're gonna come here and get a reading, you have to go to Shalimar. Like, and she's only here on Monday and Saturday. So better Currently. book ahead, excuse me. October. Yeah, so. Yeah, that's the experience there. I'm mad because I usually put like a clip of my reading in there, but it was like very weirdly personal and like interesting. So I don't know if I would have even put it in there anyways, but I'll show you the aura photo when we get back. It picked up the baby, which was crazy. So I'll show you that. And I didn't buy anything else. So yeah, that's about it. What's up guys, I'm back from Salem and I wanted to show you my aura photo. I actually didn't end up buying anything else. We just went home after we had our ice cream and packed and went to bed. And then we left the next morning. So I wanted to show you the aura photo because this is my only keepsake besides this little like postcard that was literally $2 that I'm gonna frame and put somewhere. But here it is. Look at how cool this is. It is so vibrant in person. And you can clearly see the baby right there. Um, they said that green is very playful and loving energy, so that makes sense. There's a little bit of blue around it, which like um, I've read that baby auras are usually blue. And they said the orangish red is very like creative energy, which would make sense because I'm literally creating 
a life um, and then also like um, it can be like creative as in like business or just like exploring your passions or inner child and then they said this was really cool that these little like head looking things up here are my spirit team um, and that they are like keeping the baby until he is ready to come so I thought this was so cool and I'll put a picture right here of last year's so you can see like a side by side but yeah a lot of calming down she said last year I had really intense like creative energy that was almost like obsessive like workaholic creative energy and she said it's really mellowed out um, because the clearer or more transparent your aura is the more balanced it is so she said I'm a lot more balanced and I'm very much um, and just like creative healing energy. Green is also healing, so baby energy is very healing. She said I have a little bit of green above my head. So that was the breakdown. Um, it was so cool, it was definitely one of my favorite things to do. You definitely don't have to go to Salem to get your aura photographed. I know they do it um, a lot of different cities and different places. You just have to look up aura photography, and yeah, it was really cool. Let me know what you thought of seeing the Salem vlog in the spring versus fall, I have to admit. Fall is my favorite. It was still fun, we had a good time, but it just was not, it was kind of like depressing in a way because it was so empty and like, it wasn't like the fun fall energy that they're known for, but again, still fun to see. So, in a lot less um, lines and easier to eat places. So um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe for videos every week and I will see you next time, bye.